hi guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new here my name is Hannah Renee and it is so nice to meet you today I'm gonna to be sharing with you what I got for Christmas 2020 I have been binge watching these videos since Christmas and I feel like you probably have been too if you're watching this one so I'm gonna share with you my young married college student woman <laughs> Christmas haul I guess. So without further ado, let's just jump right on into this video. So I guess I'll just start with the small things and then get to the big things. So my manager actually got me a cute little like self-care basket, which I think is so nice and so fun. So I have this little body scrubber a nail file, a mask, two bath bombs, and a beauty blender, which I'm very excited for. I love little things like this with like girly self-care things. So thanks to my manager, my name is Felicia. I got a ton of gift cards, obviously. Who doesn't love gift cards? So I'm gonna show you some of the ones that I got. I got one to my salon where I get my hair dyed. So I'm trying to figure out if I should do the same thing with my hair or if I should dye it differently. I might go darker, I don't know, or I could go lighter like I normally do. So let me know what you think I look better in, but my natural hair is probably this dark roots up here. I don't actually know at this point, but anyways. <laughs> Then I got Brewster's, which is local ice cream near us. Waggles, which is a gas station near us. I got Altered State gift card, which is a clothing store I really like. And Dunkin' Donuts, all of the essentials. I also got Target, Chick-fil-A, and Walmart for my gift cards. So I'm very excited about that. Alec did a little stocking for me this year since we have our own house and we actually have stockings. So in my stocking, I had a crap ton of candy and Cliff Bars because I really like Cliff Bars, but he also put in there two little sets of fuzzy socks, which I will definitely be using. He put an eye mask in there from Target and makeup wipes because I'm always going to the store for this brand of makeup wipes. So that was in my stocking from Alec, which I'm excited about. So next from Alec, the actual present that he got me was two pairs of shoes, which is really nice. I got white Doc Martens, which I've already worn so much because they are so cute. And it's kind of one of those things that I never would have bought myself. So I'm really glad that he got those for me. And he said that the shoes were buy one get one half off with other brands. So he wanted to give me some Converse. And I said I wanted black Converse. I just wanted the black with the white bottoms instead. But they didn't have those. So we're just going to exchange these for when they do have them in stock again. But now I also have black Converse too. So I'm really excited about that. He says my shoe game is not great. Do you have more shoes that aren't here? Um, I just have the Vans <laughs> that are not there. Ooh, shoes. Because he has like 20 pairs of shoes and I have like six. So <laughs> that's why he says that. But apparently now my shoe game is a lot better. So that's good. <laughs> Next, my brother's girlfriend actually made us a little tin of baked Christmas goodies, which I'm already stoked about and I already ate so many. So that's what that is. I feel like we have so many Christmas treats in our house that we need to start a diet here soon, but that's okay. My grandma got me a bunch of cool things. I'll just show you the small things first. So first she got a picture of them actually framed, which I'm actually excited about because that kind of I feel like you wouldn't be excited about, but I'm excited for it, especially to show my kids one day. That is a cute picture of them. And then considering we've had snow lately, they got each of us this snow scraper, but it has a mitten attached to it so that you're not freezing your hand off when you're scraping snow, which is practical and helpful. So that's good. 
Then I also got a box of C's candy. We actually, when we moved here, they didn't have a C's candy, which is really sad because me and my mom and my grandma, we would always share boxes of C's candy together because they were all over California, but they recently opened one up at the mall that's close to us. So now we get to have these candy, so that's super exciting. Next, I got this phone stand, which kind of, I mean, this doesn't seem odd for me considering all the things that I do, but especially when I have to take pictures by myself and Alex are not available, this is so helpful because it turns and you can have it different ways, it expands and all of that good stuff. So that's something I wanted and was practical gift for me. So that is great. <laughs> I don't seem very excited about all these presents, but I am excited about them and I've already been using some of them. So in this box, I have a guitar stand, which also seems a little bit random, but in this room that I'm filming in our office, it's just really where we throw random crap and there's really no organization to it. So one of the problems we have is me and Alec have multiple <laughs> instruments and I thought if we got a guitar stand that had multiple slots for different guitars, then it would look a lot nicer and help keep all of our instruments in one place. So this is something that I asked for and I'm excited to set this up and actually make our office look nicer because you should see the disaster that is behind this camera. It is very, very bad. I'm sorry if the camera angle just changed. My SD card got too full, so I had to delete some stuff. But I have two more things to show you. So the first thing, this is actually kind of random, but it's called a poop. And it's really more for decoration than for practicality practicality this you could definitely use as like a footstool but i really just had like a vision for our living room and the style that i wanted and i saw one of these on there on pinterest so that's why i asked for this for christmas because it's kind of something i would never really spend that much money for they're really expensive for some reason so that's why i asked for it for christmas and i I'm excited for it for a house. Alec doesn't really care, but I'm very excited for it. The last thing, which is also a home decor thing, is a big fake plant, which is another thing that I had a vision for. We still need to buy a pot for it, but we will get that soon. And I'm just very excited for it, but it's also something that I would not want to spend that much money on. So I'm so glad that I got those things for Christmas since I asked for them. So that is all for my Christmas haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, and let me know of any other video ideas you like to see from me because I love to do this for you. And I'll see you guys next Monday. Bye, guys.